Hello everyone, today I will be analyzing the possible plastic surgery procedures of the members of Lil Mix. This is the first time I'm analyzing a non-K-pop group, so this was interesting for me to do. This was requested in the comment section of my twice plastic surgery analysis video. If you have any requests which group you want to see me analyze, please leave it in the comments. I think plastic surgery is neither bad or good, and celebrities has immense pressure to look as good as they possibly can which can be helped by plastic surgery. I think it will be a healthier environment if celebrities in general are more open and honest about plastic surgery and cosmetic procedures that they've done, or at least not lie about it, so the general public can see that beauty is attainable through plastic surgery. I know there's a stigma around plastic surgery all around the world, but people need to realize that it's pretty common among celebrities, and it's demanded by society that celebrities look perfect, so we shouldn't blame them if they resort to plastic surgery. I want this video series to be a form of discussion between people who are interested in the possible procedures celebrities had, and break the negative sentiment around plastic surgery. I assume that many celebrities have done some sort of cosmetic procedures because their occupation demands them to look as good as they possibly can. I may be totally wrong about this assumption as I don't know what goes on behind the scenes. A few disclaimers before we begin. I'm not a plastic surgeon, nor have I gotten plastic surgery, so my knowledge in this area is limited. These are just my speculations and not facts. I have no idea about the member's medical history, and these are just my speculations, so you can respectfully disagree. This post is not meant to send hate to the members, as they are probably pressured by the industry to look as good as they possibly can. With that out of the way, let's get started. I think weight loss changed her face a lot, as she has lost a lot of volume on her face. Her lips are obviously fuller now. She likely got fillers to her top and bottom lips. She also got a lot of spray tan, or fake tan, which is very common practice in the UK for many people. She also likely got upper blepharoplasty, as her eyelids are a lot higher now. This also made the space between her eyes and eyebrows farther. This can be a sign of upper blepharoplasty. I don't think she got a brow lift. The change in the distance of her eyes and eyebrows are probably just due to the upper blepharoplasty. She may have gotten the fox eye lift procedure as her eyes look smaller vertically, more elongated horizontally, and more upturned. These are usually a sign of the fox eye lift. This procedure also made her lower eyelids look tighter. She has always had a weak profile and jaw structure, but her current jawline is very defined. This was probably partially caused by weight loss, and she might have also gotten a lower facelift to tighten her jaw area. In conclusion, I think Jessie got fillers to her top and bottom lips, fake tan, upper blepharoplasty, fox eye lift, and lower facelift. It's unfortunate that she was bullied because of her weight. She looks great now. Moving on to Leanne. Leanne didn't look to change much. She has always had ptosis. This is when the eyelid muscles are not strong enough so the eyes don't open as wide as most people's would. This makes her have the sleepy eyes look. When people have ptosis, their eyebrows become higher to compensate for the weak eyelid muscle. She also naturally has elongated upturned eyes. These factors I mentioned makes her eyes look really alluring and unique. I think the biggest change to her face is her nose. Her current nose is slightly smaller compared to the 2011 photos. She likely got a rhinoplasty. The possible rhinoplasty was really well done. It changed her nose slightly, so her nose is still recognizable. Her current lips also look slightly fuller now. She likely got fillers to her top and bottom lips. Her current face looks to have lost a lot of volume. I think this was due to partial buckle fat removal, as she didn't seem to have lost a lot of weight. This procedure brought out her beautiful strong bone structure. Her current eyebrows are also a lot thicker now. She probably used to get her eyebrows threaded so they're thinner, but likely stopped doing it. In conclusion, I think Leanne likely got rhinoplasty, partial buckle fat removal, and fillers to her top and bottom lips. She looks amazing both before and after the possible procedures. She was already blessed with an amazing face, and the possible procedures enhance her beauty in the best way possible. Moving on to Jade, Jade also didn't look to change much. I think the most obvious change are her lips. Her current lips are a lot fuller now. She likely got fillers to her top and bottom lips. Her nose also looks to be slightly slimmer now. But I think the change is so subtle that it can just be due to makeup. But I will put rhinoplasty as a possibility. 
Other than that, I don't think I see other changes to her face. In conclusion, I think Jade likely got fillers to her top and bottom lips, and possibly a rhinoplasty. She has always looked amazing. I love her big beautiful smile and her large eyes. Last but not least, we have Perry. Perry has such a beautiful eye color, and she has always had a nice strong bone structure. I think the most obvious change to her face are her lips and skin tone. She is tanner now, which is likely caused by fake tan. Her lips are also fuller, which is likely caused by fillers to her top and bottom lips. Her eyes have also become smaller vertically and more elongated and more upturned. I think she likely got the fox eye lift. Perry's nose looks similar now, especially at the tip of her nose. I think there's a possibility that this was caused by makeup though. I'm not too sure about this, so I will put rhinoplasty as a possibility. In conclusion, I think Perry likely got fillers to her top and bottom lips, fake tan, and fox eye lift. There's also a possibility that she got a rhinoplasty. I think the possible procedures were all well done. Though, I personally think she didn't need the fox eye lift because her big round blue eyes are a distinguishable feature of Perry's that many people recognize her for. Remember, when I do these analysis, I'm always at a neutral position. I don't think plastic surgery is bad nor good, so let's not spread unnecessary hate towards the members or my opinions. I hope anyone watching this takes this post in a positive way and realize that plastic surgery is not a bad thing. We need to understand that K-pop idols and other celebrities have a lot of pressure to look good, and it's not a bad thing if they resort to plastic surgery, as it is demanded by society. As I stated in the beginning, this is not meant for fuel to send hate towards the members. Thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one.